how's it going guys fusions gaming here bringing you back another forza horizon 3 gameplay so in this one i am going to be showing off the halo warhog with this amazing video so so far i have been doing a lot of progression off camera just to try and get up there in the forza horizon career and just try and progress get some new, we uh, new weapons but i'm too used to playing black ops 3 <laughs> new vehicles in this game and so far i am level 10 i've just reached it but i thought i'd just do a video on this because i don't think i've seen many videos on youtube like this i was uh, i think it was like a downloadable code you could have got through xbox live if you being like a halo player or playing halo in the past when you had this game um, but also if you buy the VIP um, the VIP purchase for the game you do get it in that I think don't, don't quote me for that I might be wrong but so far this is the first time I've been in this game it handles I mean it's a big car big wheels obviously it's gonna be heavy on the steering which it is it's pretty nifty for what it is I think you can upgrade it I haven't done anything to it I just bought a video driving to a new festival which we are going to be building when we get there and that'll be the sort of the length of the video I'm going to be doing on this video today. <clears throat> so, so far I've done a few races, I've done my first championship, got a few barn fights. I will be showing those barn fights off in the future, <clears throat> probably this week. Also guys, I hope you did have a good weekend. Obviously now it is Monday, the beginning of a new week, which means new videos coming out for everybody on YouTube. So yeah, so obviously you want to stay in, in, uh, in touch for that. So far this car is really hefty, I mean it does do 100 and what, 15 I'd say that max or no, maybe not, 120 max and obviously oh, there is a few on the road as we go on past. So far I've unlocked the, <clears throat> a few more festivals, I've been to a load more areas, I've driven the quiet down a few roads and this map is really huge, I mean the graphics on this game, okay 118 is the max for this car, which isn't that bad, standard. But yeah, the graphics for the detail on the car are pretty much like the Halo game. Obviously, they're going to be slightly different because Halo have their own graphics. So they are going to be slightly different. But from a comparison, from sort of what you get in the Halo games to this, I think it is pretty much identical. Obviously, it's bigger on this game. And I've just got, um, well, I've got T-Bone then, but lucky I didn't get spun out. Obviously, the engine this car and the armour is going to keep me on the roll. But yeah, obviously this is identical, as I keep saying, uh, to the Halo game, and I think it's absolutely brilliant. I think they, I think they've been a good choice putting a different car into the game. Obviously, they've never, I don't think they've never done this before in one of the four. Oh my god, they've never one. Ever since I've been, it's just like GTA. Ever since I get in it, everyone has one. But when you don't want have one, nobody has one, and you can never find one. But no, this is the first Forza Horizon 3 game, well, the first Horizon game, which they've put in another vehicle from other games, which is absolutely awesome. They have so many features on this game, I really do think they've nailed it on this one. I mean, if they, if they can beat this in the next one, it's going to be a hard, hard make for that game, because this is just probably the best out of all of them, in my opinion. I don't know, you guys might agree with me. If you do, please let me know in the comments. Also, if you like today's video, please do make sure you hit that like button, and if you're new, please hit that subscribe button as well. But yeah, I know it's been a while I haven't, since I haven't done a Forza Horizon 3 video. I've just, sort of just been chilling out, playing a bit of Black Ops, why it's doubling weapon XP, just to level up with some of my guns. So we have to take a right hand turn. We are almost at the venue festival where we're going to buy it, build, and then we're going off road, so we can actually see what this car is like off road and see what it handles. So let's, let's see. At the moment, it's pretty handling really, really good. Because the most, because I have one USV uh, SUV car, which is the Lamborghini, and that doesn't really handle much of well. But this actually handles really, really well. I'm really proud of this car. I'm surprised. I suppose the size of the wheels. Okay, we are going to do a quick handbrake turn. We need to build this when we can. Out back. So let's build this. Let's get a new festival site on it. So guys, yeah, I hope you did all have a good weekend and did creative stuff. So we got another achievement as well. So let's see, that's another. So we are in the Outback now, the festival in the Outback. There it so you can build, I think you, you get quite a lot and you could upgrade each one to a certain level. Which is sort of good. I don't know what that advantage, what that advantage is you get in the game for doing that. But we hopefully will see that in a few, few days or so. When I keep making these videos. 
So that is it, guys. That is my video for today. I thought I'd just do a quick one on Forza Horizon 3 on the Warthog because it's such a unique vehicle in the game, which you can do. Um, also, I did turn off the music in the car because on my last video, I did actually get copyrighted striked because of the music on the game. So I have to cut off just to be sure and to be safe so I don't get it again because I don't want my account being what... Um, copyright strike quite a lot of times but if you did like today's video please do make sure you hit that like button like i said before and also if you're new to my channel please hit that subscribe button and until then guys i will be seeing you lot in the next video peace